Let's work. Yo, it's go time, show time, never back in downtime. One shot, yo. Hello. This is Mr. Dyer with Take Tips 303, I believe. Uh, this week's Take Tips will be on just becoming familiar with the Test Nav uh, session on your Chromebooks and devices. So, in order to get to this screen here, you have to first locate the Test Nav app. The Test Nav app is located at the bottom of your screen. So, if you go to the bottom of your screen, if you're on the Chromebook, you will click on Apps and then you will locate Test Nav and click on it. Once you do that, you will get to this screen right here. If you don't see this screen, you will sometimes see um, a screen that looks a little bit like this. You basically come and click Illinois. Um, students will see this if they've never logged into TestNav before. However, it's not a big issue. Just click on Illinois and it will take you back to the section where you need to be. Uh, today, I'm just going to basically show you how to do practice tests. If you were taking a regular test, you will basically enter in the username and password provided on the testing ticket that you will uh, receive for this particular test. So I'm just going to go ahead and demonstrate how to use the practice test so that your students can become familiar with the platform. So I'm going to go ahead and click on practice test. And as you see, uh, we have tutorials for grades three through eight, third through eighth grade, or English and language arts, as well as mathematics. If I were to click on third grade, you will see we are taking the computer-based practice test. So there are two units for that, uh, for fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, and eighth. And if I were to click on mathematics, uh, you have three units for uh, the computer-based practice test for mathematics. And it is the same for third through eighth grade. Uh, so if you would like to begin a tutorial, you basically click on the English and language arts, Click on the unit that you're going to do your test on. Gonna, you can leave it. You can put your name. Have the students put their name or just leave it as guest. Click start. I would recommend using the student's name. And it gives you instructions here. I'm gonna go ahead and click start. And then we will have the practice questions and also uh, the reading passage for this particular task. Again, this week's tech tips is on becoming familiar with locating test nav as well as starting the practice test. Don't forget to follow us on social media, Facebook and Instagram at South Shore Fine Arts Academy and on Twitter at S Shore Fine Arts.